This zodiac weather is from Saturday, October 19th to Friday, October 25th, 2024. Looking first at the weekend forecast, over the weekend we wrap up our core decisions about whether or not to continue in a relationship for long term. Let's drill down. On Saturday, it's sunny and valuable. The moon in Taurus makes you feel and know your worth. Step 26 means Saturn rules the day. Knowing your worth with Saturn tells us you're ready to decide and commit to what the peace deal will be or the future will become. You're also upgrading your personal boundaries. And once the moon moves into Gemini, you're ready to communicate the change. On Sunday, it's sunny and rather animated. Step 27 gives us a Mars rule day. It's time to move forward now with what you want to do in relationships. You could say it's time to shake on it. You are receiving the conviction that this is the right thing to do. And again, a moon in Gemini makes it easier than usual to communicate the truth with one another. Now let's zip ahead and take a look at the five-day weekday forecast in the upcoming week. In this upcoming week, we transition from wrapping up the Libra energy and diving deep into intimate Scorpio. On Monday, it's sunny and rather chatty. Step 28 indicates that Earth rules a day. This is a day where you love and protect what you have served and created. This is where you honor all of your agreements and your relationships and wait for things to gel. What you'll receive is the real value of these changes. And you're initiating the transfer of power from the we to the me or vice versa. With the moon in Gemini, then Cancer, it starts very heady but then gets deep in your feelings. And this may be the first time you mourn the changes of your relationships. On Tuesday, it's partly cloudy and weighing. Step 29 indicates Chiron rules the day. This is the day where you'll receive justice and you are testing the balance potential of everything. You could say this is a real test as to whether the marriage or divorce is going to work out. And several planets indicate that there is a major change in karma. Mostly the sun scoring Pluto, a major test of heart and personal power and then the sun entering Scorpio, indicating the end of relationships and the beginning of drawing lines. On Wednesday, it's cloudy and rather sensitive. Step zero means this is a Grandmaster Pluto ruled day. You are redefining boundaries with yourself. You could say it is a rebirth or the rising of the Phoenix. What you are protecting on this day is everything, and you are feeling out how you feel as far as safety is concerned. This day will be a strange day, but a strong day, as you are deepening your roots and feeling more grounded. On Thursday, it's cloudy and moody. Step one indicates the sun rules the day, so this is a day of protecting self-love. The moodiness is due to the fact that you may feel you haven't protected self-love as well as you can. You are going to clarify your emotional boundaries to make you feel safe and nurtured. And with Mars sextiling Uranus, it's now time to get moving on some sort of construction or deconstruction project. The moon in Leo amplifies that connection to the heart. And then on Friday, it's cloudy and hopeful. Step two means the moon rules the day. And with the moon in Leo, it means your heart and feelings rule the day. And this is precisely what you must protect are those feelings and your heart. But as you bring up those walls and shelter out the gooey, you're going to find that you are changing how you feel about your story. And perhaps this is just the beginning of something magnificent ahead.